How's everyone doing today? We're back with another episode of License Plate Spotlight. Up today is Wisconsin, and I can't find it on the map. I know someone's like, it's right there, you're looking at it, but I don't know my U.S. geography. Oh, is that it? I found it. It's right there. Wisconsin, the cheese state, maybe, the Dairyland state. Wow, they're close to Canada. I should have known where they were. They got a couple cool things about them. Their flag's pretty gnarly. And uh, their bird's just a robin. I don't know, that's kind of boring. Their flower, the wood violet. That thing's pretty cool looking, isn't it? Their tree, like one of the best trees there is. We can't grow it very good in Saskatchewan, but the sugar maple, awesome tree, so cool. And they don't have an animal. I'd say it's maybe a cow, you know, the dairy province, but we had to go with the insect instead. The Western honeybee. But enough about that. We're here to talk about license plates. So here's a Wisconsin license plate spotlight. As per usual in this section, we start with 1946 and go to newer because the older stuff's somewhere else, save for a different set of spotlight videos. So uh, 1946, I have that. So when we turn the camera around, we'll show you. But uh, check this one out, we're gonna throw up here right away. This dealer plate, the date's de-embossed instead of the whole thing, or debossed, however you wanna say it. I know I said it wrong, I said it wrong. And uh, it's black and white. It's pretty cool. So let's flip this camera around and set it up and I'll start showing you what I got for plates and what we found online. Okay, well I showed you that first 46 dealer plate. Here's uh, my 46 Wisconsin American Dairyland plate. Cool oval shape. It's got the 52 tab on it. Uh, it's pretty cool. I'm going to throw this guy on the wall. While I am, I'll show you this cool orange and black farm plate with the cool tab. I know they got to go up there, but you know the gist. We'll move them after. Uh, if it's your first time tuning into a spotlight video, hit that subscribe button like comment let me know what you think uh if you've been here before you know what's going on go back watch my other ones if not uh we're gonna keep showing you pictures off alpca that's uh automobile license plate collectors association alpca.org should be up there somewhere check them out become a member and you can have access to all these images and information too i'm only showing you some stuff because you got to become a member to see the rest but uh this one a police plate with that star on there super cool 47 just a boring tab I don't know it's orange at least what else we got here this big oval plate I don't know if I'm holding it right we'll see it's cool that white and black bus plate with the cool tab on there and then 48 same as that 46 just a different tab and then we'll do it again 1950 tab cool color though that like light blue and yellow i like it very very cool uh next on the list i don't have anything for a couple more years but next on the list i found this farm plate look at that it's like a cool light gray with black like no one has that type of plate you probably wouldn't see it on the vehicle it doesn't look like it reflects or anything hides in the dark maybe that's why the farm guys have it and then this cabin plate, orange with black. I don't know why your cabin needs a plate. It shouldn't be moving. You'd think it stays where it is. And this yellow plate, state traffic patrol. How cool is that? That star on there is super sweet. Next up, the first of mine in the collection that's yellow and black. We got this big 53 j 2804 two three still american dairy land but we dropped that oval shape now we're going with the big rectangle so we'll get that guy throwing up on the wall while we're doing that we'll show you the the next one the 54 it's this plate but it's got that other tab on there that red 54 tab that just went over the 53 
I don't know, they kept going back and forth, back and forth. They couldn't decide if they wanted a stamp dated plate or a tab on their plate. It just switches and switches and switches. 55, white with green lettering. It's pretty cool. I feel like I got the same one in like 58, 60, somewhere in there. And then, uh, what else we got? Sorry, I gotta check my list. What do we got? Uh, well, look at that one. Farm plate, blue with yellow. Still that same red tab. It's kind of some weird clashy colors, if you do say so. And 56, reminds me of an old New Jersey. That black with the orange lettering. Semi-trailer, I always like the black backgrounds. They just, they make the lettering pop. Super cool, super, super, super cool. And uh, then we just got the 56 tab. It's boring super boring this next one special x plate light blue with white i don't know it belongs like the men in black maybe alien hunters i don't know what the special x plates for but it sounds cool so i had to include it in the video i just wanted you guys to see that 57 <laughs> remember that yellow with black well 57 yellow with black that's where we're at that's happening but this next one it was issued from 57 to 59. It's got yellow in it. But I bet you weren't picturing this. Antique Auto, purple with yellow letters. How cool is that? Like, what were they thinking? Let's just do this random purple thing. And then 58. Bleh, ugly tab again. What's going on? 59. Just went back to white with green. White with green. They do yellow and black white with green yellow and black white with green it's kind of boring it's kind of boring i'm not gonna lie so uh this one though you remember seeing that well this is the 60 to 61 version of antique auto purple and yellow again the purple changed a little bit i guess i don't know and uh next one i have 59 with the 60 tab on there that tab ugly orange and black on a green and white plate it's got orange and green i guess my favorite colors on a plate h46 394 wisconsin june still americans Dairyland. you'd think their state animal would have been a cow it's a dairy land they don't even have a state animal i'm, I'm very confused by this so uh, we're going to throw these guys up way higher on the wall so I can show you the next round of cool stuff. But first, check out that special plate. Another one with the star. I know you guys like that thing. It's for the official. Obviously, it says official on it, right? So only makes sense to me. That's what it's for. But uh, I gotta go find some more Wisconsin plates, so I'll be back. Seconds for you, minutes for me, maybe hours, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'll be back, okay? Okay, I'm gone. I'm gone, I'm gone. Okay, they're up on the wall. Next to show you is uh, another yellow and black, 61. It's got the 62 sticker on there somewhere too. It's getting boring. 63, white with blue. We changed it up a little. It's not white with green, it's white with blue. Holy cow, they did something different. 64, sticker. Nah. Stickers are boring. I don't know about you guys, but so is 65. 65, someone went crazy and decided we needed this maroon plate old man suit colors maroon this is like a massachusetts all of a sudden who likes that not me 68 all the way to 72 68 to 72 looks like this or like that or like that but this one's mine s93989 so uh, let me find a screw or two here and we'll throw it up on the wall. And while I'm doing that, we'll show you this cool uh, 
Finance Co. Finance Company plate. Green with white. I thought it was really neat. I don't overly know what it's for, but it's cool that the finance company had their own plate. You've probably seen that guy come and it was like, oh, time to leave. The finance guy's on his way. So I thought that one was pretty neat. Same with this. Another collector, antique auto, whatever you want to call it. 1970 to 1980. Super dark purple now. It almost looks black. It's still purple and yellow though. I don't know. That's what they did. And then this bus plate. This cool teal green. I don't know what you think it is. That bus plate. And then we got another collector plate. I don't know what the difference is between a collector plate and an antique auto. Because that's your antique auto we just seen that goes from 1970 to 80. And now we got this collector plate that goes 72 to 86, blue with red. So I'm not really sure what makes one different than the other because they overlap each other, but maybe antique has to be so old, collector can be anything. I don't know. Someone comment, let me know. Maybe you got the answer. Manufacturer plate, orange with black. Really cool. And then this one. 73 to 79 sticker madness how wild is that and i'm going to show you one more plate and then it's gonna be a message from our sponsor so uh the last plate i had to show you is here totally because of the cool color that red was black and it's a driver's ed plate i've never seen a driver's ed plate but you'd think the plate on a driver's ed car would pop a little more than that dark red and black Probably a few accidents with that guy, but it's kind of neat. But, uh, hmm. Okay, I'll tell you one more. I'll tell you one more. Dealer plate. What color do you think that plate is, huh? You answer first, and then I'll tell you. What, what color is that? Did you say orange? This is not orange. Apparently, that's peach. Peach with white. I thought it was orange, but it's peach. Uh, oh, sorry. I'll show you one more. Number 13. Special X is back. Cool number. It's just there because it's a cool number. But now, a message from our sponsor. Hello, everybody. Rufus here. Today's uh, sponsor is brought to you by LicensePlatesAndMore.ca. Hit them up. Check them out on eBay, online. They got stuff everywhere. Ships out of Alberta. Message them. Check them out. Marty's got some cool stuff. License plates and more.ca. That's Rufus telling you where to get your license plates from. Check it out. Do it. It's the only place. It's the place. If there's license plates you want, like some you've probably seen in this video, have probably come from here. License plates and more. Colington, Alberta, Canada. Check it out. That's uh, our sponsor today for License Plate Spotlight. I hope you're enjoying Wisconsin. And uh, go online and check them out today. License plates and more. There's lots of plates to buy. Lots of cool stuff. So, uh, till next time. This is Rufus. So, uh, I hope you enjoy the video. I'll talk to you next time. Huh. Oh. I'm back. That Rufus, he's uh, quite a character, eh? License plates and more. Sounds like quite the sight. I'll have to check it out someday. Where are we? Huh. Antigua Auto. Look at this thing. The car on it's cool, but tan and green? It looks as old as it's supposed to be, I guess. Ugly. And then we got this semi-trailer one. It's up there. Alpka's page says that's the oldest or the highest number in the PC series. That uh, whatever it is, 18 something. Oh, I got it written down here somewhere. We'll check this out. Mine is PC 4491. So, uh, isn't this the highest number? I don't know, but we're gonna put it up on the wall because I think you guys got to update your page. That's that's all I'm saying there. It's pretty cool. 
And uh, next, this one, this special Z plate. We'll see if the person special to me is watching this video because they like this number. So we'll see if they comment or not or pay attention. It's pretty cool. It should be up there somewhere where you can see it. I got to grab one more screw to finish putting this uh, plate up there. And uh, I don't know. There's another auto plate. It's kind of cool. And the new base. The new base come out. Finally. And it's got blue flaunt. Flaunt. Blue font on it. And right after the blue font come the red font. So I got that one. I don't got the blue one, so I don't know, but I got this one. UNJ. 534 still America's dairy line what do you guys think of that one and while I'm hanging this up I got a couple cool graphics to show you from 89 and 90 the EMT graphic uh, and the firefighter graphic they should both be popping up there at some point but check them both out they're really cool and when I get back down I'll show you something else cool I have there's gotta be something And then we'll show you this one. 1980. Black and yellow. Yellow with black. AX3666. How cool is that? Triple six plate. Wisconsin. Yeah. I know someone that would like that plate. Yeah. I do. That's pretty cool. So it's going to go on right here. Right underneath this awesome chalkboard we got on the go. While well, I'm putting it up, I'm going to show you something else cool, but I don't know what I'm showing you because I'm not looking at the list. So when I turn around and look at the list, I'll tell you what I just showed you. What is it? Something cool? Oh, right, yeah, it's a state patrol plate. Doesn't that look like a Canada dry symbol? Oh, that's what I thought. I thought it was kind of cool. And then we got some university plates. University of Green Bay of Wisconsin. University of Milwaukee of Wisconsin. And uh, before I show you my cool color plate, look at that cool dealer plate, that yellow and green. Really cool. I like that one. But I like this too. This red or blue with red. The red super faded so it makes it look like almost a maroon color. I really like it. I think it's super cool. And uh, while I'm hanging this up, I'll show you that endangered resources plate. It's pretty cool. And another bright yellow plate. I don't know, football fans out there, the Green Bay Packers. That's pretty cool looking too. What do you guys think of that guy? I thought it was pretty amazing. And, uh,. Which one do you want to see now? 1998. Did you see that? Did you? Sexcentennial. I don't know what that means, but it means it. Z4289T. That one's pretty cool. What do you guys think of that one? You like it? We got a couple more university plates uh, while well, I'm throwing this guy up. You know, that university, Madison with the Badger, and the University of Superior with uh, the Wasp or the Hornet or whatever you want to call it. It ain't a bumblebee, but it's something. So there's those two guys flapping up there while well, I'm putting up this thing I can't read. And I got two more plates left in my collection to put up. So before we put those up, let's show you a plate that would go on a vehicle I would never drive. If you know me, you know me. Low speed vehicle. Uh, that's not me. Definitely not me. Then we got the Milwaukee Brewers. I, I'm not 100% sure, but I think they're a baseball team. I don't know. I don't really uh, watch them. So, And this next one. 
I want this next one. If anyone at all has one of these plates for sale or for trade or wants to give it away, I would love it. Historic military vehicle plate. That army green, so cool. Way cooler than this current issue, 310 ZAU. We went from red letters to black letters now. It's about all it's changed. A little barn going on there. I don't know. Will I throw this guy up? We'll show you a couple more endangered resources plate. There's a badger and a bald eagle. So we'll throw both them up there somewhere. They're pretty cool. And uh, next we'll show you this other one, Harley Davidson. They got their own Harley Davidson plate in Wisconsin. You'd think it'd be motorcycle size, not full size like that, but. And uh, there's this one, it's pretty cool and bright and it's for a good cause, you know, cured children's cancer. It's a pretty good one. And then we got this one in the collection, Children's Trust Fund. Uh, we just seen this one a few mystery plates ago, 15592K. I can't remember which one, but go back and watch all the videos, you'll find it. Hit that subscribe button, like, comment, let me know what you're thinking of the videos. And uh, after you subscribe to my channel, go check out my buddy's channel, uh, Ryan the Scavenger. He's got some cool license plate stuff going on too. And uh, while I'm plugging everyone, remember to hit up license plates and more. Go buy some license plates. And uh, check out alpka.org. Become a member, sign up today, get your magazine, all the information you want, and start collecting license plates. Now that I've uh, plugged everyone I can, I've shown you all my Wisconsin plates. There's four more plates here that are really cool. And I would like to find all of them to add to my collection. So there's these uh, these Juanita Nation. I don't know. I don't know if I said that right. But there's the turtle plate, and then there's the bear plate, and there's the wolf plate. Those three are all super cool. Those black plates, really like them. I would love to add those to my collection. I don't know how hard they are to find, but this last one. It's the plate. I need this plate. I'm Wooly, the crazy license plate guy. And this plate has a Wooly Mammoth on it. Come on, someone hook me up. I need the Wooly Mammoth plate. Anyone. Send me a message, comment, let me know what's up. But I need that. It's a Wooly Mammoth. I'm the Wooly Mammoth. I need that plate. Anyways, that's it for Wisconsin license plate spotlight we got them all up i don't need to move the camera you can see them all so i want everyone to have an awesome day awesome week awesome month awesome year awesome forever find some cool stuff get into trouble find some license plates send me some license plates i like license plates as you can tell but just have an awesome time and do whatever you want be happy and uh till next time you ready? Are you? Huh? Huh?